we don't wanna grow up. Today we're going to Cape of Good Hope Nature Reserve or otherwise known as Cape Point. Mm. After 90 meters, go over the roundabout, taking the first exit. It's a national park as well, so... <laughs> South Africa has a lot of uh, nature reserves, a lot yeah. of national parks. So. Weird. It's good. It's, it means that all that territory is protected, which mm, is good. It means everywhere wild animals can pop up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Where is Darcy? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe at Cape Point you'll see Darcy. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> <laughs> So we went down, it's quite a long drive, but the road's quite pretty, there's lots to see as you go in. Only rocks. Where is that? That's your Why even now when you see the tail? Well, we'd be very surprised to see the fur of the dusty with no dusty. <laughs> Normally they're attached, you know. You need to make it the ticket place right there, close to that point. Moggy, I, I know what Moggy's expectation was. It was like, in the gate, two minute drive, Cape Point, one minute walk, Okay, done. Back we go. Man, yeah. Not back home. Souvenir shopping. Ah, okay. I forgot the souvenir <laughs> shop, yes. You get to the viewing point, and because I think of Corona, it was really empty. There weren't oh. many other people there, which was quite nice. And then, ah, oh, we saw something cable car kind of thing is moving. Then, oh, we can take that one. Then yeah. we walk there. Closed! <laughs> Noying! Oh. Everything closed! <laughs> It's only a 15 minute hike. Oh, yeah. Like, and uh, in the um, information. information, they said 45 minutes. Yeah, but that's right to the point. Remember, mm. we weren't going right to and the point. And then, I, I want to walk. Ah, this is crazy. I want to go. And then he asked to that person, how, how long does it take to walk up to there? And then, ah, ah, it's only 15 minutes. And then, ah, Not bad. bad. Still bad. <laughs> lazy, lazy, lazy. Anya, yeah, because like wind is crazy. <laughs> Cape Point, may I just add, is the windiest place in the whole of South Africa. So <laughs> if you go there, just expect a little bit of a breeze. What breeze? Breeze? No, hurricane there. <laughs> You know, electric fan, mm -hmm. right? Very high speed, and then if you sit right in front there, and then you have that kind of speed of that wind, you can't really breathe. That is happening to me. Ah, oh, I can't breathe, and I'm walking. Well, there's no wall. <laughs> oh, lovely weather, Captain. Hiding. Every two steps, uh, where is she going? Oh, she's sitting in the corner again. Get out of the wind. But you found some like lower areas. Mm, I mean, <laughs> me. Well, every corner having pool. Wow, annoying. The three peaks. First peak thing. Ah, this is safe house in there. Blowing. Where you go? So Moggy was loving this trip so far. Come quite far already. If she can make it, I'm pretty sure you can make it. And it's a beautiful view as you go up because you the higher you get you look back and you've got the the, the ocean there, the cliffs. It's really incredible. If you look back, wind We're halfway. I don't like wind. This is not right. Okay. Beautiful view, though, right? Whatever. 
Get inside. Uh, look at that sea. <laughs> look at the colors. Hey. There is some um, some nice restaurant which one is having nice oyster mm. family. That restaurant, where is that damn restaurant? That one closed. Yeah. Ah, there is nothing to go in. <laughs> Traveling in the oh. times of Corona. <laughs> Once we go to the top of the hill, there's a few little like trails you can take. So the main one is the lighthouse. And then from there, you can also walk about another 30 or 40 minutes to get to the actual Cape Point. To be honest, you don't really need to do it. Your views are just as good from back here. <laughs> so first we, I went to the edge of the cliff and Moggy didn't even want to come with me. She was like, I'm going to stay here out of the wind. You go and fall. My expectation, if I go up there, then I can find the least sheltered place. Damn, everything closed. I can't really get in there. <laughs> <laughs> what is this country? Everything shut. <laughs> <laughs> that is scenery. No, here, like, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> But you gotta go up, it's just like the view is beautiful and it is to say you've been there, which is it's the most southwestern point of Africa. Whatever. I will you can't even take a picture there. Well, I'm <laughs> <going> there <down. laughs> Jamie, sir. Ah, don't go there. It's not worth it. <laughs> I would say go there. No. It's still beautiful. Uh, no, no. And um, it's definitely worth it for the views, in my mm. opinion. When a lot of pool, and then you need to go up, up to the hill. <laughs> the most highlight part is uh, inside the car, I found the tortoise. Ah, that's around. true, we saw a tortoise, yeah. That is the best thing I ever seen <laughs> there. Mm. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, so mm. click the link, you know where. Mm. And comment. Yeah. Comment. Comment. Tell comment. us if you think you'll go to Cape Point. Yeah, like. I want to. I want to hear this because <laughs> I think she's overreacting. I personally. want to. I want to hear someone who has similar experience of me. <laughs> probably there is one of people there. Probably at least one. Oh. Mm. We'll see. <laughs> Look forward to these comments. And otherwise, we will see you again next time. Mm. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> If you see baboons, don't get a fright. Mostly harmless. Don't, don't run or scream or anything because they're not the most friendly animals. Don't, and also, if you're carrying food, don't actually just don't carry food. Because if you're carrying food, then they'll approach you and try and get it. And if they do, just drop your food. Oh, and I heard they can open the car. Yeah, so. <laughs> lock your car. Unless you want to arrive back at your car with baboons sitting in the front seat.